the LSE Law Department. Uh, well, what was the question? Why do I like the Law Department? That's a tricky question. Uh, well, I can say a lot of things. Can we go for another question? Yes. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I think lots of us watched Suits before applying to, to do law here at LSE, yeah, so it was like a, a bit of change, but I mean, I expected that, that there would be lots of reading, so yeah, I was prepared for it. <laughs> I knew there would be a lot of readings, I knew we would have lectures and classes, um, but what I didn't anticipate was the wide range of skills that we would kind of develop here. It's been a lot more comprehensive than I thought, so I came to law thinking that I would be studying mostly application stuff, so like going to court, as you said, but it turns out there's a lot of normative reasoning and a lot of historical background behind it. I was first appointed in the law department in the 1990s. Uh, I was delighted because it was uh, a world-class institution, but I was also coming to a law department uh, which had practiced law in context well before that term was invented. My training had been in doctrinal law, black letter law, but at the time, uh, I realised that although that was essential, it was only part of the story. I wanted to be an LSE when I was a kid. I mean, that sounds corny, right? Why? Because of this magical idea that there could be a place which is a university but doesn't call itself a university, it calls itself weirdly a school, which is devoting itself to the sociology and social sciences and political stuff, of which law is a part. For over 100 years, the law department at the LSE has taken this broader approach to law, that law is a part of the uh, broader society and economy. And to understand law, you have to really appreciate the context in which it operates. From the first day as an undergraduate in the LSE Law Department, you are taught to place law in its social, political and cultural context and to think of it uh, not just as a set of regulatory practices, but also as a normative phenomenon that constructs and constitutes the very reality it purports to regulate. It all makes sense when you go into different fields of law, because all that contextual knowledge is very important to understand the practice area that you're going into. Um, that's been the golden thread. Uh, and that's why I uh, like being in the Law Department. One of the things that really struck me about kind of how LSE law is run is kind of the international outlook. LSE is one of the most international universities in the world. Both students and professors, they come from different countries, they have different cultural and academic backgrounds, and they bring different views and different ways of dealing with a particular topic to the classes. So I come from a state school in East London uh, where the demographic wasn't very varied um, and coming to an institution that is so international really shapes the way that you view things. And this makes courses very engaging and interesting. Like kind of, there are so many people from across the world who just have, have different experiences about different jurisdictions about the world. From Asia, not only from Europe, also from Africa from North America as well. And when you're studying law in, in England, you kind of just kind of put in a certain kind of frame of mind that, you know, everything is about English law. But actually when you consider that things about having going in Malaysia or the things that happen in Singapore, you know, or things that happen in Australia, all of that kind of links into how English law operates. Rather than just having a discussion about only Europe, you can have opinions from people from all over the world and I think that's a very, very valuable asset for the LSE. And for me that was quite interesting to just have that experience that, you know, you, what you experience on a day-to-day -day basis is it, so different from what someone else has and, and being able to be kind of opened up to those experiences has been quite, quite good actually. And I think that that was a great added value to the classes uh, because especially when you're discussing subjects like, for example, competition law or, uh, or regulation, uh, people can bring their experiences from their own home countries to the class, and that makes it even more interesting. There is a commonality, though, and it's that everyone is brilliant and very well prepared. And at the same time, they're very willing and open to listen to what the other has to say. So I would say that this combination of diversity, excellence in an environment that is tolerant and very open it makes the LSE a very stimulating place to learn.
The thing that I like most about the LSE Law Department is the sort of community feel. The fact that we have a community here. We're a very collegial department and we work extremely well as a team. Um, so this was reflected in the first couple of weeks of first year where we had like law drinks, we had um, LSE law families being introduced to us and that's kind of a concept whereby uh, we can really engage with other students in other year groups and also we were assigned a mentor so I was assigned a third year mentor um, and he organised sort of meetings with us um, to discuss any concerns that we might have, any tips that he can give, up, give us. And I think that was so crucial in terms of forming this collegiate atmosphere in the LSE where you can really feel part of the environment. I'm not really a hierarchical person, I would say. I treat everyone the same with, you know, the appropriate respect. But we all, we all talk to each other and we all approach each other as we're all working towards the same goal. What's really nice about working in the law department is senior staff are very approachable. So you're able to speak to the professors anytime, whether it's about your assignments, whether it's about any personal concerns, and not only the academics, but also the administrative staff are also really friendly. We all just work really well as a department, and I think we're considered in the school as a very strong department because the professional services staff and the academics just have a lot of respect for each other. And I really appreciate the friendship, the collegiality, and we communicate about everything and we work together really well as a team. The community feel also goes on after your three years here um, at university whereby they have an LSE Lawyers Alumni Group. For networks, uh, for building relationships, there are so many things that you get out of a community that just isn't possible anywhere else. Uh, because of its location. Of course, the location of LSE is great. LSE is right in the heart of London. Where you can visit many historical places, and especially, even more important, those related to law. So next door you've got the Royal Courts of Justice, just down the road you've got the Old Bailey, law firms and barristers chambers surround the LSE. So it's really the best place, I feel, to study law, because everything's right at your doorstep. The undergraduate and the master's students really get a benefit from being in the heart of London, near Lincoln's Inn Fields, yes, for sure. I had uh, my public law classes during the first year, so we were studying Brexit, like a case about Brexit, yeah, and I remember how straight after our classes we could easily go into the Royal Courts of Justice to attend this historical hearing, so yeah, amazing. Geography is an incredible thing. If you're right next to something, you engage with it. So we've had events in the Royal Courts of Justice and we've had an awareness of the courts. Many of our colleagues, including myself, have argued in the royal courts as barristers. And I think that sense of engagement with the real world, um, law academics practicing law as well as teaching it, I think has given people a very real sense. It isn't an ivory tower. It's somewhere where people are deeply engaged in activities around human rights, around international law, around EU law and rights and I think that makes it a particularly interesting and unique place to be. Together with the proximity to Parliament and the city, what makes LSE unique, because London is of course unique, having all of them wrapped into one, but LSE is absolutely at the core of all three. That shows through in the, the department's public events programme and the engagement with the external world. And I think that means that the, the institution is very much at the heart of London rather than accidentally being here. I was teaching in one of the buildings, Tower or something. All the students got excited. Why? Because they could see Sir Paul McCartney entering the Royal Courts of Justice by a special entry. And we are that close that you could see people come and go from the Royal Courts of Justice. And it gives you an amazing psychological in. I met amazing people here and I'm so happy that I spent three years of my life here at LSE studying law. It's, you know, it's really helped me in my confidence, my career and, you know, I am proud to work here. For any students who have just started out or are thinking of studying law at LSE, um, I really, really encourage you to if you do apply, really kind of make the effort to make the most of your three years here. Um, I think LSE is somewhere where it's completely what you make of it as opposed to things handed to you on a plate. Um, so I think that um, you can achieve literally anything you want to if you just put your mind to it. Um, it just takes a bit of effort and time and passion.